Good afternoon to those who listen. It is March 27, 2018, 12, 14 p.m. And here's a look at the sun without clouds. I had somebody say, how come you don't shoot videos of the sun simulator without the clouds? I do it all the time. <clears throat> so here's another video without any clouds. I mean, there's one little lone cloud off in the distance, putting it on default. I had it on negative three because it's so bright. What's wrong with my focus? Yeah, here's the landscape. We got no clouds. It's like cloud free except for that little lone cloud by himself. All right, here's default on uh, detail, the default brightness. And here's minus three. Still got the bite out of the right. Somebody said that the bite out of the right, that circle that's beside there, moves with the camera. No, it don't. Look, it stays the same. It's not moving around. It's stationary right there next to the right side. So just showing you this. So there's one person's comment said that I never do it without clouds. Well, this is a cloud-free day. And some people, somebody said, oh, that bite out of the right, that dark spot looks like it's moving when you move the camera. Is it moving? I don't see it moving. No. Anyway, another person commented and said, uh, do you ever, can I take a, a video from a different location? Because I mainly take it from my uh, balcony. Let me bump up my from my balcony. It's a small balcony. I'm up on the third floor, and this is where I usually take my videos. I have, <coughs> excuse me, I have a couple of videos from Denver when I went to Denver. I have a couple of videos when I was in Glenwood Springs, and actually, I'm going to be going to Glenwood Springs in an hour, so I will take a video when I get there just to see what we got. I mean. It's probably not going to be nothing. It's probably going to be like this. Like this. This is default. Look at all those rose petals. Go back down to minus three. See, I got so many people complaining. Oh, your the sun's flashing. It's because you're doing it yourself, or because the camera can't handle the brightness. So then I lower the brightness, and then most of the time the flashing goes away, and you can see more around it too. So that's a good thing. But I can't control it when it flashes when it's minus three. If it was to start flashing now, I couldn't control it. Couldn't stop it. And then I got another person who says that I'm putting filters over my camera. I have never put a filter over my camera uh, except for the Eclipse glasses and the CD. But I always tell you when, and you can definitely see the difference. I mean, it's nice and orange with the Eclipse glasses and it's blue with the CD. But... I'm not putting filters on it while I'm recording. No. Unless I specifically state. I haven't used the Eclipse classes in a long time. Let's just show you what it looks like. 